Hello everyone. Um, I'd like to address several issues. Uh, first of all, let's start with the matters of war. The worst fighting continues um, in the Donetsk uh, region in the eastern Ukraine. Um, and again, Putin is blaming everyone for what is going on except himself. That is to be expected. Remember a statement by the Russian government accusing Ukraine of playing at nuclear terrorism? And these are the people who are accusing Ukraine uh, of nuclear terrorism. They're putting rocket launchers around a nuclear facility. Let that sink in for a sec. And there has been a confirmation uh, from President Zelensky's government that indeed there were Ukrainian operatives deep within the Russian territory to guide the drones that struck uh, military facilities um, some serious distance away from Ukraine. There are several things going on that I want to talk about that are tied to like all these different bits and pieces. First of all, the far right is already screaming how dare Biden administration exchange the black female lesbian basketball player instead of a white male Marine who is also in Russian custody. For starters, uh, the Marine, uh, Paul Whelan, was taken into custody during the Trump administration. At the time, the U.S. already had that Russia's arms dealer in prison. So that deal could have been negotiated back then, but Trump administration never took it on. Second, the two families presented a united front and said they understood that it was going to be one or the other and that getting Brittany Griner out, the, out of there would have been somewhat easier than a Marine who was accused of spying, just based on the charges. Something else, the arms dealer that is now headed back to Russia as part of this exchange might have been a lot safer in the American prison that he's going to be at home because Putin has a KGB attitude toward failure. So there might be a slippery balcony incident in this arm dealer's future, especially now that Putin is chafing after Ukrainian operatives had popped deep into Russia and out, carried out their mission. So there's some going to be some serious head rolling. We shall see. Thank you for watching.